Doctors Adam Mildenberger and Catherine Wood are out for a walk in the town of Peace River. It's the dream of every rural Alberta community to have two younger Canadian trained physicians practicing in their town. So why did this couple choose Peace River? Well, for starters, Peace River is a training community for medical students. Both Catherine and Adam first came here to do their ICC, Integrated Community Clerkship. It's a very welcoming community. I remember as an ICC student uh, playing on the basketball team, my wife went to a book club, you know, something that felt more like home as opposed to just the place that you worked. They returned later to do their residency. We find that having learners here is one of the best recruitment tools ever. Just having them exposed to a rural area and how much fun we can have helps in many, many ways. Dr. Lungard leads the team that is responsible for recruiting new physicians to Peace River. She is also the physician liaison for the Peace Regional Healthcare Attraction Retention Committee. She relies on that committee to help her in recruiting. The uh, Retention and Recruitment Committee has really put a community face on the recruitment. Prior to having the committee, recruitment was all done mostly by the physicians. So it, it lessened the load on, on the physicians and it actually made the recruits feel a bit more welcome from a community perspective. The committee's goal is to show prospective medical students the many lifestyle advantages of the Peace region. In fall, when med students are here for their month-long clerkship, the committee takes them on a jet boat ride up the Smoky River. Those three med students were really appreciative of, of seeing nature up close and it was just a fun afternoon for them and for us. Deciding whether you want to live in a community means deciding what are you going to do when you're not working? Are there things to do outdoors? Do you feel like the community is welcoming? Are there extracurricular activities you can get involved in? And I know Peace River in particular has always been a community that really works hard to include both the physician and their family in things around the community. Adam had extra training in anesthesia and Catherine in surgery. So the opportunity to advance those skills in the operating room at the Peace River Community Health Centre was another key factor. Peace River has for many years worked to establish a fantastic surgical program um, as well as endoscopy program where we have um, a couple senior colleagues who I know that I can call with uh, for advice and also the volume where I'm still getting enough to keep my skills up. Dr. Karen Neopani is also a Canadian trained physician. She was drawn here by the mentorship provided by other physicians, especially in surgery and emergency. I've always been interested in rural medicine for a few different reasons. One, of course, is the scope of practice, so I can do a lot more here than I could in the city. Karen's husband, Pradeep, works in the area as a registered nurse. Together, they love getting outdoors in the Peace Region. It's a beautiful town to live in, and there are lots of recreation opportunities right in town, so you know, it's easy to go out for a run. There's a big hill right behind my house that I can run up. Uh, we have a canoe, so we're exploring local canoeing opportunities. The Peace Regional Healthcare Attraction and Retention Committee's role is to showcase all those amenities to new recruits. When we're told that there's a prospective uh, physician coming to town, we try and host them at a lunch. And um, one of our real estate people in town has been very good about touring them around the area and providing that local commentary. Pre-COVID, the Attraction Retention Committee has always hosted an annual barbecue to show their appreciation for local health professionals. They also actively help physicians get comfortable in their new community. The committee's been a huge help in recruiting physicians to Peace River. You know, physicians are often arriving and they're busy and they're unpacking and, and they get this lovely welcome basket that's full of goodies and fruit and things that just makes life a little bit easier in those first couple of days. They definitely helped us feel welcome. The committee is just a little over three years old. It includes members from five different local governments. The MD of Peace, the counties of Northern Lights and Northern Sunrise, the village of Nampa, and the town of Peace River. They meet four times a year, lately on Zoom, and they all get along well. We're all neighbors. We know each other. So we meet on other committees, and it's really a, a fun committee to be on. One of the biggest accomplishments as a group was organizing an RPAP-sponsored post-secondary skills weekend for health profession students from Edmonton and Grand Prairie. 
Many of those students had never been exposed to the rural lifestyle before. They visited a dairy farm and an air ambulance hangar. They hiked along the Peace River and checked out the statue of gold mining legend 12 Foot Davis. The committee organized a delicious community dinner for the students, as well as a lively night of entertainment in the local theater. Oh, it's really cool to come somewhere like Peace River, which I've never been before. Um, it's really fun to meet the community and to see like how much the community has come together to show us how amazing it is here. Peace River! The committee has nominated two previous RPAP Rhapsody Award recipients, the Operating Room Nursing Team at the Peace River Community Health Centre, and Dr. David Welsh, a family physician. Now it's the committee's turn to bask in the sun. Congratulations to the Peace Regional Healthcare Attraction and Retention Committee, recipients of the 2020 RPAP Rhapsody Community Award. I'd like to congratulate the committee on winning the RPAP Award. They're a tremendous asset to the area and keeping the health community vibrant. And thank you very much for all the work you do. And on behalf of Northern Sunrise County residents, we want to thank the Retention Committee for the great work that they have done throughout the year and congratulations on your award. On behalf of the County of Northern Lights, as Reeve and on behalf of my council, I'd like to offer congratulations to the Peace River Committee on your recent nomination and uh, award. I'd like to say congratulations to the committee for winning the Rhapsody Community Award. The Village of Napa has benefited by all their hard work in promoting the Peace Region to attract new doctors to our area. I am very pleased that they won the Rhapsody Community Award. They are well deserving of it. They put in a lot of time and effort. It's just a great honour to receive this award and uh, we look forward to a big celebration.